there has been number of studies which have tried to explore the correlation of the use of mobile phones with the instance of brain tumors or in cancers in general. Now there have been several experiments done. As you probably know and it is my duty to inform to our viewers that mobile phone technology is based on radio frequency waves. Radio frequency waves is basically under a spectrum of what is called electromagnetic radiation and they follow some physical principles. All electromagnetic radiation potentially can cause some harm to a living tissue. However, radio frequency waves that are used in mobile phone technology is at probably the lowest end spectrum of the uh, electromagnetic spectrum. Now electromagnetic radi uh, spectrum sometimes for example we ourselves use radiation therapy for the treatment of cancer is a highly, highly high powered energy which can cause direct DNA cell kill in the tumor cells. The radio frequency waves that are being used for the, for the mobile phone technology is a lowest end of spectrum and does not cause any DNA kill. For it to actually prove that it causes a direct DNA mutation into the cell so as to cause an actual cancer has not been proven so far. There is, there seems to be a feeling in most of the physician or medical community as if there is an increase in cancer and there is an increase in brain tumors. This we have in our own series which we have collected, we collected national you know, registry in our own hospital. Much more robust data would come from uh, European or American national registries and if you look at the American registry which is called SEER database which is one of the most robust and widely followed databases. In their series in the last 10 to 15 years there has not been any increase in brain cancer.